then okay what is the second method you are doing the second method is in so you are using as a you can using as shd0 so you want to remove the entire icons okay particular transaction okay so for you so i want to remove the icons from entire icons but this true method sir this is to measure what happened vector 1 and vector 2 the two methods are is applying only single user IDs. At a time, you can using as only one user ID can restrict it. Okay, but when you go for third method, so you want restricting as a entire, you want restricting as a entire transaction code. So third method is so how to restrict the okay, how to restrict the transaction level security. So you're using as a SU24. Means suppose anyone using this SVG, anybody so spouse so on so client number okay so anybody using as a anybody using as a this transaction like SU01 PFC0 R S U G R S U10 okay so I want to disable the entire activity of these guys I want to disable the create icon disable icon everybody but these two methods are single 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 so, so you want to stick single user ID so you can stick single user ID but when you go for this method, you can restrict the multiple users, means mass users at a time. So how to do? So you can using as a SU24. Okay, what is SU24? And you know discussion of SU24. Before you want to discuss, you want the difference between the SU22 and SU24. SU22 is nothing but just display the okay, display display the authorization. Okay, just display the authorization of this or they fire the particular transaction code but when you go for this su24 okay change the changes and creating and add the authorization of this like maintenance okay maintain the uh, maintain the authorization of this for the particular transaction code. so how to do we will discuss one by one so how that uh, will be there now we go for practical session okay how to do this so no target is but method one and method one you method one and method two you have to go for only you have to providing either if you want to put the restriction for single user id when you go for method three so you want to restricting as a transition who are using this transition code everybody automatically be restricted okay so how to restrict it again i want to know particular transition code okay particular transaction code what is the method we stay okay how the scenario will be going on so you can discuss it as a one by one sc24 so now i have to go for log on to sap software i want to make a present for you okay how to restrict the particular transaction code to assigning as a particular operation object so now go for transaction code sc24 IP address already is there, just drop down it. Just drop down it. Okay, okay, okay. not save anything. Okay, write down MS. What I did, it not. Yesterday I saved it. Yes, yes. Yeah, below one, last one. GRC. You know GRC very well? Yeah, yeah, I know GRC. Okay. So go for login page. You can close this all.
ఓకే లాగ్ ఆన్ టు జిఆర్సి ట్వంటీ త్రీ డెవలప్ అట్లా జిఆర్సి ట్వంటీ త్రీ డెసర్ట్ ట్వంటీ త్రీ ఓకే పాస్వర్డ్ ఓకే దెన్ గో ఫర్ ట్రాన్సాక్షన్ ఫోర్ సి ట్వంటీ ఫోర్ so yeah enter any transaction which transaction for you want restrict it so you can restrict it so enter any transaction ko no need only one is fine so i want to restrict one by one okay then click on execution button this is the multiple values okay click on okay and click on execution button Have you seen this method before? Huh? You know this method? Yeah, for restrictions, uh, it's we are in authorization objects, no? so we can restrict it authorization objects. Yeah, authorization. So how to add the authorization object, you know that? How to add the authorization object? To SU24. Hmm? To SU24. So that is okay. Uh, for example, in a PFCG adding SU01, you are getting a... Here you are getting a... Say, like 50 60 authorization objects is there but when you go for pfcc you're getting us only 526 why either it's they are restricted uh, or uh, you know we are not getting that details uh, so we can restrict it as you put it to end up okay okay no sc20 so the- restricted that's okay but i was asking so why check indicator check indicator is about the purpose of check indicator here SU24. You have an option, check indicator option, you know that? You have check indicator option. Check in. Where is it? When you come, when, one second. Once, when you go for this, you're getting that. Once you open one more screen. Once you log in, you can get that. Once you log in, center the user ID. I say you have to create your user ID now. You can create your user ID, so your own user ID. Yeah, yeah. You can create left ID. That is not full access. No, no, that is not, you don't have full access. I say so after that, you can create one full access user ID. Okay. Okay, sir. Same one, SU24. Yes. Can I enter the... Mm-hmm. Enter only one transition is better because you're doing multiple, multiple single values to see it over. Can execution directly. Yeah. Yeah. No, SU01. Okay, now here, so in SV01, what is how many authorization objects will be there? It will be right side, will be, so you will be getting a lot of authorization objects. Yes, sir. Okay. Mm-hmm. So totally, you go more than 50 is there. But when you are assigning this in a PFCG, in menu tab, so at the time in author, go for authorization, how many you are getting? You are getting only 5 or 6. Okay. 
ओके बिकॉज ऑफ यूर चेक इट इगेट प्रपोजल इज एना प्रपोजल सो इज द टैब स्टेटस ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ द डिस्क्रिप्शन अ टीएसटीटी टेबल नेम चेक इट इगेट प्रपोजल पैकेज कंपोनेंट नेम हियर प्रपोजल टू दिस एस पेट पॉसिबली गेम इनटू द पीएफसीज सो प्रपोजल इज नॉट इज नेम मोस्ट या या it is not reflecting over there we can be restricted yeah you can restrict so which one you want once so then you can restrict it there okay so here what are the objects p underscore t code p log and sns code address so those object will be as so which one you can apply so you want to change the proposal as yes then automatically getting as a spf switch but now my target is i want to restrict it select this so go for s underscore us underscore grp Uh, can i open new screen or same one no the no, same one only so go for the authorization object is s underscore us underscore grp i want to restricting as a three transaction code first method you discussing as a s underscore us underscore grp underscore grp no no vs er correct here is is finding na so now here just double click on what is meaning of authorization object authorization of this is nothing but collection of authorization fields so you getting as two fields what the two fields a b c t and class okay yeah. again what the options will be there so what i get only display activity and you can restricting as a multiple member just click on active class you cannot define here you can only can define just click on change button is display mode just click on change button SG24 is a display mode now. Just click on change mode. Change mode. No, not there. Not there. In above one. Display the transition SG24. Just below options is the tracing is up. Uh, yeah, just click on change button. Okay, now it's getting at the change button. Okay, now you are able to change it. Just click on change button. Yeah, done, done. Okay, already changed. Already changed. Now, so you what are the activity you want to give? You can give the all the activities. Okay, but you don't restricting as a class. Second phase you don't restrict it because a class is nothing but here group. Which group we can restrict it? Okay, Let's close this. Close this activity. Okay, now uh, class also class you cannot restrict it because of that is a class is nothing but a group. Which group we can restrict it? That is go for only PFCC. Now see here field description and organization you cannot do that it. you can maintain it you cannot maintain it is a manual so you can go for pfcc you can check it and next one i want restricting as a uh, role i want to restrict a role so what is the authorization of the you want restricted s underscore us underscore agr select the authorization yeah. of s underscore us underscore usr underscore agr Hmm? Yes, sir. 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 Yes, underscore usr underscore h mm -hmm. why <coughs> no yes here only user user it is uh, check it close this and check it there, there i think a proposal is now even is not gain su0 we are adding su0 scroll down Just be your after that. You do you scroll down. You can minimum close this. Minimum minimize this. He by S underscore yes 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 is this this minimize it. S underscore project. Let's 
स्कोर रहा स्कोर रहा या दिस वन यस जब लेके करेंट नाउ so you want to give the activity again this is also display activity you want so see here already somebody changed this is also display activity okay only on display okay already is there you know click and what are already zero three is nothing but display okay there is nothing but just icon okay now again activity okay now again so i want to stick the transaction code then where we go s underscore us underscore tc TCD. Yes. Okay. Again, so you want to give the some restrictions. I will click on it. I think I have changed one again. Click on save button. Previously is not saved. As under school, just place it is not saved. Now you can click on it. Hmm. If the proposal is actually is no, just propose a proposal as yes. Check indicator and proposal as yes is not there. So just click on yes. Oh, is getting okay. Now click on change button. SU zero one I yeah only SU zero one can able to add it. Remaining transition is not able to add. Okay, now. So now you can restrict it. So now who are using this SU zero one PFCG and uh, Yes, you are here. So everybody is restricted, but if a group is not restricted, you can go to particular groups. Okay. Okay. Based on this. So can I save it? Yes, you can save it. Then go for. Click on OK button. Can I close this window? Yeah, you can close it. Yes, yeah, so users 23 and create one room and assign this transaction code. Pass. Yes, yeah, caps lock is on. Yeah, I just change it. Smith is ready for that. So now, can I run SU zero one? Yes, you can run SU zero one. Hmm. Any user ID? Yeah. Any? No, no, no need to go directly. Just go for role. Okay. Create one user ID. No need to. Already just checking purpose, na? Okay. User does not exist. No, no, no. I say user bus. I just say exist, but like I want testing purpose. Okay. Hmm. Create any user ID and assign to the role. Fax number is again. Not even a fax number. We 
click on save button Okay. Yeah, can I log out and log? Yeah, now go for PFCC. You want to stick in now? You want to create enroll, you can assign it and you can assign it. Now, authorization object you're getting by default. So, create one role. Create any role. Okay, then click on create button. Yes, go for description. Okay, then click on save button, then go for send the what is the transaction code you restricted, then get set the transaction code. You restrict in SU01 and PLCC. Only one transaction no? Yeah, in SU01 you restrict overall. SU01 and PLCC. Okay, then click on assign it. Okay, now go for authentication tab and change the profile name. Give the proposal profile name and change the authorization data. Just click on S button. So close it. Go for utilities, technical names one. Now check it what is the activity you have to go for S underscore ESL underscore EGR and S underscore ESL underscore JGR uh, sorry EGRP. Check it by default you are given so that activity you're getting at the 03 only. Only display. Why is getting away? Is not reflected. Why are you getting all am I getting a go for a GRP? At least GRP S and S for yes and GRP. Is reflected. Okay. And you go to S and S for yes and S T C D. So this is only yes. PFCC wise previously. If you go only SUG means only SUG is reflected. It's not used. Why? Because uh, you want to take a three requests. So you can only one request. That way it's not story. Okay. Actually, you have to give the three requests. You do three times. You get three requests, but it's only one request will be gained. And that's why it's not change the balance. So anywhere you know that is okay. Just click on generate button. Again, actually, you can change the uh, group name and generate and login and check it. So, this is the third method. So, who are using this? Actually, what is our mistake we are doing? What is the mistake is nothing, but actually, you are getting three transport requests, but you are giving only one transport request. Changing anything. Mm -hmm. yeah, that is the one reason. Okay, give the Harish one, two, three, or something. And the reason is not as not exist. Huh? Harish address correct one two three. And previously creating a sad something. Click on enter button. Yeah, user comparison. You then click on yes button. Okay, this is a third method. You can providing in SU24, you can change it. So now you're doing everything is a standard method. You have any customizing methods in say. Yes, you have customizing methods also. Okay. So I want to make a presentation. So these are three methods. Okay, till now you're discussing one by one. Yeah. Now you have to go for what is the security rule? And now you we are using till now you are using everything with a custom. So everything is a standard methods. Now I want customizing my project. So even authorization of how to creating authorization of how to create the class and how to creating as a Everything, everything customizing method for security. Before you want to go for this method, so you want to know the security hierarchy. So customizing for entire security. How to customizing your project? No need using any standard method. Only you're using the customizing. Okay. So how to do it? So before you want to know, you think you know that security hierarchy. So tell me. First of all, what is meaning of transaction? What is meaning of transaction code? Transaction is basically to execute the work, you know, a transaction we can assign to user to that do specific that, work. Okay, that even normal guys are like, yeah, everybody will be transaction that is working shortcut, but as a security council, our definition is different. What is the meaning of transaction code? Just now you're running SU24, you will see that. Yes, okay. SU24, only you will see that. What is the meaning of transaction code? What is the transaction code contains? 
Authorization objects, authorization activities, classes, fields, values. Okay, yes. So transaction code consistor, what I first first of all. Okay, first of all, what is meaning of transaction code is nothing but transaction consistor classes. This meaning of classes. This meaning of classes. Okay. Activities, classes, sir. Uh, Classes. Classes is nothing but a modules. Normal language is a module. C department, you can okay. get security like basis department, that is a PC. Okay. RMM department, or finance department, or controlling department, or SD department. So, why, why those are dividing is nothing but when you're designing the transaction code. Last class, you discussed how to remember the transaction code. So, how to remember the transaction code? Suppose, suppose that the transaction code starting letter S letter. What is this meaning? So, what the code, yeah? so it's a security department, our basis department, our above department. All technical departments will be starting as a compulsory. Technical models are starting as Go for functional models. Suppose you have to go for So, because so you're starting as a F. Yeah. Okay. So, even MM module, the transition is starting with M01. Suppose you want to go for SD channel, so already SD is a technical model. Let's go for E. Already, yes, later, yes, later, is very technical module, sir. Yes, sir. So that's why you can go for the starting letter is easy. EK01, like this. It's also a picked out the MP01. Okay, you can see that as a second, you can see the transition you identify. Okay, this is the transition of PICO department, this is the model. So because of those are categorized into the classes first. Okay, again, okay, this is the classes. Even for example, you know, VW security. Okay. PW so what are PW what so PW is a third party PW PI okay PO is a third party tool it is a third party securities the transition code is starting with R later RSA one RSS and mixer then we go for HR department the transition code starting with P P log P log P and P twenty so like this Okay, so based on this, okay, the why those are mentioned is the transaction code like this is based on the modules only. So more is a can be technical. What is the meaning of the authorization class is nothing but is a modules. Modules. Okay. Again, what is the meaning of this is just normally what is the meaning of authorization classes? Class is nothing but collection of authorization objects. Okay. Class is nothing but collection of authorization objects. Again, what is the meaning of authorization object? Collection of authorization fields. 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 Okay. Fields consist of authorization activities or values. Okay. So when you go for, sir, your theoretical is very well, but I want to go for practical session. Where will you see this all? So where will you see this all? Where will you see this all? So you can use the transaction code SU03 and SU21. Okay. So this is the creation of, and this is the display purpose of. Now oh, you can do that also. Okay. Now say now so classes again object is starting with again technical what is starting with S underscore yes underscore GRP. All technical module may be S underscore GS Suppose when you go for finance department, what are the number starting with? Pin underscore F underscore bank or consumer or company code like this or getting other you getting as a B UK like this. Okay. And fields is not our purpose, is it uh, like a uh, like uh, above guys are given? So and activities. By default, 190 activities is it? So, sir, we can go for this, okay. But when you go for table level, how to see this overall alteration of the common objects is the way we check is nothing but TOBJ, alteration object. Okay, please, where you check the act piece is not there and go for table step T act. T act is nothing but to see the first time overall activities and you can go for TOBJ to operate when T classes, T as T classes for the table T class. Okay. So table level, these are tables that we can monitoring and go for transition of 11, SU0 to SU21. And where we are assigning this all, okay, you can assigning as a profile, you can assign the transition when you are in uh, class and option MP. And when you go for this, where we commit this package, where we are getting is, again, you can assign this to, you can assign, I can assign to the particular profile. Or particular, directly you can assign the profile, or I for transition. Okay. Or, Again, role can be, sorry, profile can be assigned to the 
people can be assigned to the a role uh, a specific role role, or role can be assigned to the um, role can be assigned to the transactions use what is purpose to create the role you want to restricting as a uh, restricting uh, restricting user so restricting uh, right okay this is no once i had a gap so first of all what happened so what is meaning of transaction code transaction code is nothing but collection of authorization object and authorization fields and authorization activity and even where we see the transaction code how very clear the authorization like you're not creating mm guys are giving the transaction codes where you see the transaction is sc93 okay so again what is meaning of transaction code in security department transaction code is nothing but collection of authorization classes fields values and activity okay and after this so where i can assign this so i can assign to this overall objects and everything to the where we assigning so i can assign to the profile again either you can assign the profile either you can assign the direct transition again so what is the profiles again profiles can be given to how many types profile can be given to how many types profiles can be given to one two types this for single single, single. okay single uh, profile and one is the composite composite profile so how to create a single profile how to create a composite profile where we was a transition to create this so you can use the transition code as you 03 so i want to go single i want to refer mass you can use the transition code is as you basic okay so now tell me sap underscore all sap underscore new what are this sap all basically contains all the transactions so we can restrict it or the authorization of the example okay all okay all the sections is it as okay that's fine right? now i'm asking so what is this sap underscore all what is meaning sap underscore all all means all transactions all profiles <laughs> that is a profile what is that profile actually you have to how to give the full access to your user id that will go for the underscore profile tab you have to give the full access sap underscore all okay So you are getting as all system authorization is okay. What is that profile? Is a single profile or composite? Is a composite. Composite. Is a composite profile. So in real time, you don't using any composite to any way. Okay. You don't say you say only security concern basis must be there. And the same and the school remaining will be restricted as per the requirement. Okay. Clear? Yes. We do the practical. You can clear everything. Okay. Comment the profiles in. Yes. Again, profile can be assigned to the. Actually, when you go for a role tab, role will be having different different tab. What are tabs? Is a prescription tab, menu tab, and authorization tab. In the authorization tab, what we are doing? Just click on propose a profile name. You are getting as one profile. What a profile you are getting? T underscore zero 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 something. You are getting that. So that is your yes, proposing sir. system will be generating one thing. But you want to create. You are assigning as manually. You want to create one profile. You can assign manually. How to assign means? Here you can creating and assign to the role. Okay, we have to propose. Yeah. We have to click on proposes and thing, but system will be generated one thing. But you want to create customizing. Okay, so what is this? So and again roles. Again roles can be given to how many types? Roles can be given. Single role, single role, composite role, and then there are other roles. Where we create other transaction using PFCG and PFCG, PFUD. What is PFUD? UD. Which one? PFUD. PFUD. It's a display. P F U D. P F U D. Mass data reconciliations. Okay. Mass data. So mass role data reconciliation. Role data only. Okay. And role can be assigned to the particular user ID. Again, how to create the user IDs? What are the transition create user IDs? You can use the transition. S U zero one. S U zero one. S U zero zero. I. All choices you can go for scripting and L S F W. And again, users can be divided into how many types? Users can be divided into five types. What are those? Single user, okay. Single user, composite role. Sorry, single user. Okay, sorry, sorry. So, what is this? So, so single user. Next one is the uh, single user. Uh, one person. Multiple so, users. Yeah, rows, rows. Dialogue user, reference user, system user, communication user. Yeah. Target. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, reference dialogue. This is the hierarchy. Okay, this is the high security hierarchy. So till now you are discussing is everything is the standard only. Okay, everything is the standing method only. But now I want to customizing. Okay, so I want to customizing the 
like i want customizing everything as per our requirement how to customizing okay so how to customizing this everything you know what we are doing is standard organization objects standard classes and standard fields and standard elements and everything is standard only for our body so now i want to customizing as per the my client requirement okay yes sir okay now how to do this so first of all what we do now i want to first of all i want to create the class class gets an object object is the field field can be the activity then i want to create the profile profile can be the role role can be the so remember this is a hierarchy you want to run your cycle then only you know the security very well okay cycle very very important from customizing and size is a security hierarchy okay so this is a secret life check is called for one by one okay now we want to go for practical session so first of all how to create the authorization class where you create authorization class okay so now go for transaction code su21 how to create the authorization class till now you discussing because everything is a i mean now i want to create it as a customization yes so everything is cuz i don't using any class i know so i want customize okay just click on create button again so in create option fourth icon last one is fourth icon yes expand this icon it will be just click on again first of all you want to create the class or object in first we can create cl a class yeah class so see here you will be getting all classes just wait we are getting all the standard classes the bc underscore a see here when you go where you getting this bc underscore a a b a c where you getting below upset below just the bc is your authorization class right side get the class and object and text is there na okay yeah yeah this one so a b b c underscore a b c underscore z where are we getting this when you creating the role in authorization tab you just click on technical name you getting those na okay how to getting this yes, one because here only those are here here those are creating then only so select any class yes. select any class here bc underscore a select any class expand it class consist of these are all, all object now check it s underscore yes and admin is saying scroll down and see one class how many operation object is there s underscore yeah x underscore yes sir underscore grp authorization object where are we getting where are we getting that Which class bc underscore only na yes yeah bc underscore okay again object consist of as per definition as bit consist of fields what are the fields will be there here what are the fields will be there fields is there na so you have here class is there don't close so okay. class class and activity yeah uh, class and this is the authorization fields fields consist of fields consist of uh, user group and uh, values no no i say fields consist values. of values security hierarchy values fields is there na permitted yeah. activities just click on permitted activities So everything is the yes, hierarchy sir. is there. Don't be. Yes, just click on permit activity. Yes, just click on. You can get the overall activity. These are activities only, na? Yes, sir. Okay. Now, so the diagram is satisfied or not? If the diagram is satisfied or not? So here you are selecting the class. What the class you are selecting? Classes. Uh... So see here, what is the class you are selecting? B C underscore. You are selecting the class. Okay. B C underscore. Class consists of one object. What is the object? Not one object, multiple, but here one object. I am selecting. What is the object you are selecting? S and S and S for you. Yeah. Okay. Object consists of fields. What are the fields? Fields. Okay. C U L S C S. Class. Okay. So class and activity. Okay. And the field consists of values. What are the values? Is there here? Values. Zero, one, two, three. So this is standard yes, format. Yes. Same thing. I want to create in case customizing as per my requirement. Okay. Yeah. So how to create it? Okay. Close this. Now understand the diagram. Yes, sir. Okay. okay. Close this. Now click on create button. First of all, you want to create the class. Create button. No need. No need. No need. Just press. Let's do it one by one. Now I want to do everything is customizing. Just click on create button. First of all, you want to create a class. Now you want to do customizing compulsory name. It should be compulsory starting with Jadar Y letter. Okay. So everything is Jadar Y. Yes. Now create a class. Right click on create button. Create the object class. This one I done, done okay. but it's showing me this. No, no, not there. No, no. Don't select anything. Is actually you select create button. Create button. 
close this and click on create button. Uh, expand the create button. You can get the object class. Uh, object class. Okay, now we have entered the class name Z underscore Harish. Z and Hari. H -A, just H -A -A. Z. We will just pull no, capital means capital caps small H A. Z H A. Okay, and meaningful this. Okay. This is a Harish class. Harish duty class. Okay, the click on save button. Now check it below. You're getting as a now. Okay, it's asking access. One second. Uh, it's off One second. I will. I will do it. You can show because I actually I will access. I don't have access. Why is asking access key? Because you do a software change. Eh? Wait. So now tell me, now tell me what will happen first of all? First of all what we do? So you want to go for? With class. Yeah. No, SU21. So tell me the navigation. SU21. Are you able to see my screen now? Yes sir. Okay, now select the class. So I want to create as one class. Ready here. This is the SAP security class. Okay, now click on save button. See. So it's asking as a local app. Suppose you do doing a JDR violator, it's asking you are getting error. Other than JDR violator, you're getting error. Because uh, what is the error you're getting? Foreign names are not specified. Foreign names is not specified, nothing but you don't use it as a standard letter. Now check it. Where is this? So created now. Yeah, sir. Okay. Suppose I get this error. I am. Uh, I was. I will get this error feature. So who will provide this information? The software package. Access. Or? Access. Access key. No? Yeah. Who will provide this? Uh, access key is provided by the basis consultant. Okay. What is the access key is asking? Is not to read the access key. Read the what is the access key is asking? So the access key is SSCR access key. So you want to request to the SSCR access means SAP. Software full form is SAP software change request screen. You are changing SAP software or not now? So I sir, I don't want anything. I don't want any A to I don't want any standard method. I want to think customizing as my request. So that's why we want to ask this key SSR key to the SS concern. Okay. Even when you want to uh, changing as a actually access key will be having as a security department will be having the access key. And above department will be the access key. These two guys are need for access key. Because of these two guys are changing the SAP software as per the client requirement, as per the business requirement. So that's why these two guys are compulsory no risk. Okay? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. okay, so now my software is only no as access key alert like that. I will give the access also tomorrow. Okay, I can give the one link, I can download it, okay? Okay. Yes, so now here see this class class consists of so select our class okay select what a class I is class I want selecting as a object at the object. Okay. so so I go I'm using as my customizing that underscore usr underscore grp what is actually a standard operation update s underscore usr underscore grp but I want to right. use it so you can go for customizing so you have to go for see this for uh, user single user maintenance. Okay, single user maintenance. Mm -hmm. Okay, now object consists of fields. Fields you can get a standard. You don't have taking as a okay. What are the field names? A B C T. Mm -hmm. Is it A C T T? C C C T. Mm -hmm. A C T. Activity ACTVT ACTVT AC VT VT activity. Okay, fine. Thank you. 
and next one is the class class fields are you don't change because you don't clear the fields it just click on that. so see now what the object what the class i'm selecting i'm selecting my own class i was selecting as my own organization object but i'm using as a standard now here field consist of field consist of activities i want to give it so what is the activity i want just click on save button so i want to assigning as a xc here maintain the permit activities for this operation update so click on what is the axis you want now you're getting as overall how many activities everything is displaying I set a total of 199, 198 will be there for the depending on the software will be on the activities. Okay. So now you have to select this authorization object, which and which are what are the activity you want to work, what the activities you want. So this can be using as an implementation project when you go for any implementation client is asking i don't want sap software i want everything is customizing so you can use this method okay yeah. but transaction are standard or we can uh, we can create one own transaction through s38 oh no, no no you don't create you don't have authorization it means you want to create one transaction code for sc93 you can create it again he's asking as x so again, you want to create a transaction code, okay? Above top, I said average, yeah, above top, I was writing as a coding. Okay, everything. You want any coding now? You want to create a transaction or not? Is okay, one application. You want to write functionality, mm -hmm. you know, write the functional capacity. Everything is good to those guys. Even in companies, uh, some companies are customizing. Suppose company go for essentially go for AU01 instead of SU01. Right, right, right. So, like yeah. those customizing as per the requirement. So we can we can create the uh, all the customization transition through SC ninety three. Yes. And we can assign. Yeah, we can assign the same once we define these objects as classes. But you don't have. Yeah, you can. Yeah, you can define. You can define your own classes and object and everything. Okay. We can also create our own authorization instead of we can select SU uh, GRP. We can yes. own, create one own uh, authorization object also. Yeah, so under the end, I'm selecting as Z and as you know, I'm creating my own object only here. I'm not doing anything. Yeah. I'm selecting instead of I bring as S under, you're going to get Z and S. Just a minute, even if you yes. not given the same naming, yeah, Z GRP. You want to know this meaning that what is the purpose of this uh, object? You can do any naming convention. Hmm. Okay. But it should be compulsory starting with Z R Y letter. You can give it a Z. Yes, uh, Z, okay, Z R Y letter, so you can do. So loading all. After this uh, class and object and field, field where we assign this assign code to the, I can assign to the. I'm not assigning directly to transaction code. How to assign directly this to? Two methods is there. So I can directly assign this to operation object to. Where are we assigning? So now my target. Yes, we can go to the role and we can assign this your authorization object to number two. Listen, listen to the question. So now I want to create everything. So I want to assign this uh, authorization class and uh, object. Okay. And field and field activities. So directly transition code. I want to assign directly to the transition. Where we go? I want to assign directly to the transition code fields and activities of okay, values. I want directly assign to particular transition code. Where we go? How do you know this? PCD. Uh, PCD or SC93. So, where do we assign this class and update and feed and feed? Where are we assigning? Now, I'm creating what the class I'm creating. I'm creating the class is Z. H A is my class. Okay, Z underscore ESL underscore GRP is my authorization update. I want this to adding to the my particular SU01 transition code, RPF, CG transition, any other transition. So, how to add this? I already know this method. SU24? Yeah, SU24, you can add it. Okay, in SU24, you can add it. Okay, in SU24, so go for SU24, enter the transaction code. Okay, so enter the transaction code, just click on here, one option, just click on change button. After change button, you have to just click on, one option is there. 
add authorization object. Just click on the add authorization object. We can approach it and select the what we creating, and just click on add. Select it and click on add. No okay. Okay, in standard transaction also you can adding our custom agents. Okay, clear? Yes. Huh? Yes. Because it is standard. Now I'm go for everything is custom. So when you go for particular everything is full full knowledge. Server is too slow. See, I will show that how to add. After this done this. Yeah. We are adding go for transaction for SU24. So enter the which transaction you want this? Any transaction you wish. Okay, then click on execution button. Okay, now here just click on change button. Now we are going to put this option here. Okay, add the address. So what are the you are creating? Not updating. Then underscore USL underscore. GRP. So already somebody is so somebody is doing have activities. Just he's adding now. So now just see here. Actually, he's getting as when you're adding, he's getting as yellow color. Hmm. Okay, two fields also there now. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hmm. So again, he had activities. <laughs> he had good activities. Then click on. Save button now. See here what activities you want to give all activities this day. When you go for standard, now see here how many activities there. Mm, all 190? So 198 more than 199 is selected. Depending on software, you can say so. Which one you want? One you can select it. When you go standard, how many are you getting? You're getting is only five or six because of those is customer. Only are known of you everything. Now you want to customize it, you can select it as per your request. So I want only four or five. Okay. So, yeah. so even you can class actually when you go for standard you don't add the class you can only display buttons you don't have it now here it is restricted so which group I want restricted so you can get the overall groups okay so I want restricted every group so you can see a training one training training two everyone is there now I want restricted give the full authorization then we can see. but when you go for standard you don't have this option for this is where we change where you add the class, you can go for PFCG. In PFCG, you can add the rest. But here, when you go for customizing, you directly can assign it. Okay? Yes, now click on Save button. Now, actually, previously, you did the wrong this. Every time you want to create one request, what is the request? We will discuss later classes when you go for translation method. You can do this. Okay? Customizing. No. Customizing the. Okay, then click on. Save button. You get a different year. Previous is different year, now it's different number. Okay, now is a save transition. Now it's added success. Now check it, it's added and is active because a green color. It's added now. So even proposal also is getting what I propose you getting clear as now I want to go for a role. Okay. So I want to create one row. Now he's getting this one. Previously, you stop now. Yeah. And that is the. Yeah. This is also created. Two objects I'm creating. Okay, now I want to create the role. Where you create the role? Go for transition. We have CG. I want to assign this transition code. What happened? Automatically you're getting as a Z underscore yes underscore GRP. Yes, you're doing successful initiations. Okay, this is a way of you want to do the customizing profile. Even I'm not using the profile. 
So tomorrow you can start the profile concept also, how to create the profile. And now I am, what is the method I am doing? Now I want to create a the customizing, authorization class and everything. I was in transition. Actually, what is security policy? Yeah. What is standard policy? You want to assign it to the, what are we assigning? You can assign to the profile. Let's see, what is the profile? You can assign to the profile. Okay, profile can be assigned to the tool. Tool can be assigned to the tool. You can assign yes, the sir. directly. You don't use the authorization. For example, you can use this method. You don't using a transition. Right. Sure. Okay, directly, you can do this policy. Suppose you can use this. Sir, I don't want this policy. Directly, I can this. Okay. So the, yes, everything is discussed here only. This policy. Okay. So this is the secret. So we discuss tomorrow this. Okay, we will discuss tomorrow. So my answer, what is the class okay, tomorrow? Sir. Four to six. Okay, evening four to six. Okay, this is. I will share this documentation yes, and video for a video recording. Okay. Okay. So Thank tomorrow you so much. Continue. So I Harish back. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you.